In this lesson, I'll show you how to find a point where a line intersects a plane in 3D space. The question reads, find the point at which a line with the parametric equations written underneath intersects the plane 4x plus 5y minus 2z is equal to 18. To find that point, all we have to do is substitute these equations into where we see x, y, and z. So let me demonstrate. We have 4 times x, which is 2 plus 3t, plus 5 times negative 4t, minus 2 times 5 plus t is equal to 18. The reason why I'm doing this is because now I have an equation that's exclusively in terms of t. And that means I can solve for t. Let's go ahead and do that. 4 times 2 is 8, plus 12t, minus 20t, minus 10, minus 2t is equal to 18. If you solve for t correctly by gathering up all the like terms and solving, you should end up with a t value of negative 2. If you find a t value, you can then substitute that into here, where you have 2 plus 3 times negative 2. x is equal to negative 4. Doing the same thing here, you should have y is equal to 8. And over here, z is equal to 3. So the point in which this line in 3D space crosses through this plane is at negative 4, 8, and 3. That's the answer to the question. But before we conclude, keep in mind that every line that's in 3D space can be written as three parametric equations as shown here. And these parametric equations actually tell us more information than simply an equation. The fact that there's a 3 here, a negative 4 here, and a 1 in front of the t's of each of these equations, that actually gives you the x, y, and z components of the direction vector for this line, as discussed in one of our previous videos. The constants of each equation, 2, 0, and 5, represents a point along that line. And there you have it. That is how to find the point where a line intersects a plane.